bringing back some colors and some curls for the end of the year, guys. Who's ready for it? Who's ready for it? So a lot of people have been asking about how we wash our condition our hair and what kind of products we use. I'm going to give you kind of like an intro of how we wash the hair after we get it off the head and what kind of shampoo we use and a little bit about how the label works in the factory as well. So check it out guys. It's an uh, egg-based shampoo on the egg. So it's leaving protein in So guys, as you can see, everything with the hair extension business is a very labor-intensive process. It takes time, especially when you want good quality hair as well as good handiwork. If you rush it, you will not have what you need. This is called a heckle machine used to remove the short hairs in the bundles. The hair you see left over in the metal nails is actually the hair that the Chinese come and buy and heavily process with acidic chemicals to strip the cuticles. Over here we have handmade bundles and closures. These pieces take at least 10 days to make by hand. Notice the careful attention paid to detail in making sure each knot is tied into the lace at least twice or two and a half times to prevent any kind of shedding when installing these frontals and closures. This is a technique used by hair vendors and owners to test the authenticity of hair whether it is human or synthetic. If it is synthetic it will burn like plastic and smell bad. Remember to always wash your extensions with organic, non-chemical based stuff to make sure there's no dye or other additives on it. And once again, come with us to India and visit our factory to learn all about the human hair industry within India. Thank you for watching from Hair Main India.